Bismillah walhamdulillah wassalatu wassalamu ala rasulillah wa ala alihi wa sahbihi ajma'in amma ba'ad Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello brothers and sisters Hello everyone, welcome back to a brand new video In today's video, I want to talk about my first time praying in the public and what was that experience like and also to share some of the things that can be useful to people who have to pray in the public as well as to ask for some tips and advice to all of you who is watching this video who might have more experience praying in the public so that you guys can share any suggestions, advice or tips for those who have to pray in public in the comments section down below. Before we start the video, remember to like the video, remember to subscribe and turn on notifications if you are new and also share your thoughts or suggestions and tips about praying in public down below. Some of you watching this video might know that I recently switched my job. I quit my old job and I joined a new company. At the start of this year, when I became a Muslim, I was still in my previous company. And during that time when I became a Muslim, there was this, you know, pandemic ongoing all around the world. And because of that, since I became a Muslim, I've been working at home most of the time. So I can either pray at home or go to a masjid nearby to do my prayers. But since I started my new job, I work from home less often because my job scope requires me to go to different locations or different areas and it requires me to travel around and that means that for my prayers especially Zuhur and Asr I have to pray outside either in a masjid nearby where I am or I have to perform my prayer in public areas and so in the past week for a few days actually I have to pray in public areas either because my schedule doesn't allow me enough time to go to a masjid or there is no masjid around me and so, for the first time, I actually have to pray in public places. And the experience of praying in public was really different than praying at home or praying in the masjid. And before we get into some of the experience that I have praying in the public, I want to share with you some of the things that I bring around with me during work that is important for Muslims to bring around, especially for those who work outside and need to go around and might not have masjid nearby. So usually, at work, when I go to work, I usually bring two very important things. Number one is a water bottle. It's about a 800 milliliters water bottle. And I bring a water bottle because just in case, sometimes I do not have access to a masjid nearby. So I can't perform my wudu properly in the masjid. Or sometimes I, I'm at just places that don't have public toilets or don't have toilets nearby. And I have to still do my wudu before I pray in the public. And the second thing that I bring is this tiny prayer mats, right? So I have like quite a few prayer mats. Um, I have another, I have two more that I, it's, it's not here right now. Basically, I have these different um, prayer mats and they are really small. So it is just a very tiny size enough for your face, for your knees and for your hands. And there's two reasons why I bring this, right? So that if I do pray in the public, you know, I have a clean place to put my face on. And the second reason why I bring these prayer mats around is because currently in my country, if you do visit a masjid, you need to bring your own prayer mat. And this is really very important. It is so small, it is foldable into a very small size, you know, you can just put it in your bag. And it is very important for every Muslim to have this. And I would recommend this. There's many different versions of um, po pocket prayer mats. I have different versions as well. I have one that is uh, with, a co with a small compass on top and it's a, it's a different material. And it, it is also very useful as well. So now let's go back to my public prayer experience. I've actually had to pray maybe three or four times in the public areas and the experience of praying in public is actually very different because you know I'm afraid that if I pray in public right people might walk by and you know ask me what I'm doing or you know stop me or you know there's so many things that can happen right people can come by and talk to you or whatever because it is not very common in my country to see Muslims praying in the public I know that in some countries you know like Saudi Arabia you know people stop by on the roadside when it is prayer time to perform their prayers beside the road. I've seen some videos on that, right? So it is not that common here. And for the past few times that I need to pray in the public, I will find a staircase and I will just hope that, you know, no one will need to use the staircase or walk by me at that time. Because, you know, I'm just afraid that people might see me and people might need to use the staircase and I might be blocking their way. You know, there's so many worries that I have when praying in the public and because of that I tend to not concentrate as well when praying in the public you know I hear every bit of noise you know when people are walking by far away or we, when people open their door or close their door you know every little bit of sound you know is just amplified so it is really I guess a nervous experience but no matter what you know I still have to try my best to concentrate and finish my prayers and there was actually one day 
you know, there was one day when I was praying at the staircase, there was actually someone that came down the staircase that I was using. And when he was coming down the staircase, I was like, oh man, I hope that he don't stop me or anything. And I hope that I don't block his way and I hope that he has enough way to just walk past me. And Alhamdulillah, I couldn't see his face or anything or his reaction because I was looking down at the floor, but he just, you know, squeezed past me because that was a small staircase. I used the small staircase because it was like at the corner and, you know, not much people will use it because, you know, it is very secluded. But just nice at that time, there was someone walking down that staircase. And so when he actually walked past me, I felt relieved that, okay, wow. Oh, I can still continue my prayers, he did not disturb me or anything or talk to me, um, which is, you know, I guess if he talked to me, I know that I'm not supposed to respond to him or anything, but I just don't know how I will react in that situation, you know, because I'm the one blocking the road. I don't know if I should shift a bit for him to walk. I've never had that experience, I hope that. I don't have to experience that. But these are the things, you know, that we have to go through as Muslims. Because no matter what happens or no matter where we are, we still have to pray our five daily prayers. And the past few weeks, having to pray in the public was quite a nervous experience, you know. You're just afraid that people might come to you or disturb you or just, you know, or just see you in general. And yeah, so I want to ask, all of you, you know, what is your experience of praying in the public? You know, do you have any tips or any places that you tend to pray in the public? I know some people, they go into changing rooms in the malls to, to pray. I think that is a very good tip as well. But I haven't had the chance to use it yet when I'm in the public. But um, the past few times that I had to pray in the public, I just pray at staircases because I couldn't find any place better. So let me know if you have any tips to share with me and with other viewers on how you all pray in the public, if you have to and what it was like and any tips or advice on how to concentrate better when praying in the public. And I also know that for ladies, it is also inconvenient to pray in the public because you know that there's guys walking around and guys might see you. So I would like to hear from all of you the viewers who's watching this video, what has your experience been like praying in the public? I think for Muslim countries, it is actually much easier because I think most people already know um, what you're doing. But I think for some other non-Muslim countries, I think it might be harder to pray in the public. So let me know what your experience is like down below in the comments. I am looking forward to read all of your comments. And also, if you guys have any topics or video requests, feel free to leave it down below in the comments as well. I will see all of you in my next video, inshallah. I hope that all of you have a nice day. Jazakallahu khairan. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Bye-bye.